Welcome to the VMware Integrated OpenStack product demonstration. In this video, we will demonstrate how to manage VMware Integrated OpenStack security groups. Before we begin, we need to modify our security group settings so that we can access the instance. If the instance is using the default security group, it allows all outgoing traffic. However, ingress traffic will only be accepted from other instances that belong to the default security group in this tenant. So when we try to log into our OpenStack instance, we are unable to access it. In the OpenStack Horizon dashboard, we click on Access and Security under the Compute menu, where we can view the default group rules. Instead of modifying the default security group, we will create a new security group and add an SSH security group rule to it. We click on Access and Security again, and then the Create Security Group button. Provide a name for the security group. The description is mandatory, and in this demo, we describe it as Secure Server Access for Administrator. Once the security group is created, we can add rules by clicking on Manage Rules, and then Add Rule. Rules define which traffic is allowed on instances assigned to the security group, and you can enable ICMP, define a custom TCP or UDP port range, or use one of the predefined rule templates. We select the predefined SSH rule from the drop-down menu. Once the rules are added, we confirm that TCP port 22 is open for SSH access. Back on the Instances dashboard, we click on More under the Actions column, and select Edit Security Groups. We edit the instance by adding our Management Security Group and click on Save. When we try to access our OpenStack instance, we are now successful. Note that our instance is able to access the outside world. We launch our OpenStack command line interface to perform the same security management steps. We first verify the existing security groups and group rules. We then create our new security group called Management2 and associate it with new rules by specifying the protocol, ports, and acceptable IP range. We run the Neutron Security Group List command to see that our new security group rules are defined and associated with our new security group. Finally, we add the Management2 security group to our instance and see that it has been applied. This concludes the VMware Integrated OpenStack product demonstration. Thank you.